Okay, get the audio back for the game, and uh, let's continue. Uh, there were some other stuff, I think, and that was the prologue, which is basically the tutorials from the first game. I already went through them. They're pretty much the same thing, except with some new stuff added, like bushes and picture in picture, and all the good stuff from Hitman 2, so I'm not going to try to do that. So let's go with the next mission in line, which is the finish line. Hopefully it loads up a movie. Oh, no, here we go. Good afternoon, 47. Your destination is the annual Global Innovation Motor Race in Miami, Florida. After analyzing the data from Reynard's computer, the case is clear. The Providence defectors are Robert and Sierra Knox, head of robotics developer Kronstadt Industries. A visionary inventor and technological innovator, Robert Knox has spearheaded Kronstadt Industries to the bleeding edge of technological development. His equally brilliant daughter, Sierra, is not only a financial wizard, but also a fiercely competitive race car driver with a fiery temper to match. Kronstadt enjoys enormous popularity with global consumers. However, few are aware that the company is also one of the world's leading suppliers of next-gen military tech. Last year, despotic ruler Jin Po employed prototype Kronstadt drones against peaceful civilian protesters in the now infamous Tanyan Valley incident. And although it has yet to be proven, there is little doubt that the Noxes personally brokered the deal, making them complicit in a war crime. It is unclear why the Noxes would betray their masters, but likely the fear of being next put on the Shadow Client's hit list has pressured them to cut a deal with the enemy. Undoubtedly, with Kronstadt Industries on their side, the militia will increase their attacks tenfold. And so our contract obligates us to retire Robert and Sierra Knox and contain the damage they may inflict on Providence. I will leave you to prepare. All right, there we go. That's what you, we gotta do. That's what I gotta do. To take out these two targets. Any method, any disguise, any method, any disguise. Um, let me choose the uh, outfit here. <laughs> Florida fit. No, I want the signature suit. And um, let me see if I can smuggle an item. Hmm. Can I have a um, sniper rifle? No, not yet. Okay. Um, hmm. Let's do an explosive. Uh, event entrance. Aha. I can't do anything here. Well, you know what? Let's get a... Um, let me adjust myself in my seat here. Let's get a pistol. Let's get the chrome. Chrome looks good. All right. So I'm playing this on professional. Not doing master yet. Let me uh, get into the game first. And of course, I'm going into this level blind. Uh, yeah. Put the guide on. I don't care. So, I'm going to try to do that with all these other missions, just to uh, go into the the levels blind without uh, knowing anything, without having to play them at first. So, yeah, <laughs> hopefully I can do this one without too much uh, mess, I'm trying to be a hitman, I'm trying to be Agent 47, after all, but, uh, you know, sometimes uh, plans go awry. And, uh, I'll have to, um, improvise. <laughs> Whoa. Welcome to Miami, okay. 47. The innovation race is on its last day, and it is down to the wire. Thousands of eager fans are gathered for the final laps of this unexpectedly close race. Sierra Knox is expertly piloting her red Kronstadt car, her father, Robert Knox, roams the nearby Expo building where Kronstadt is showcasing its new prototype car. The Kronstadt RK Mark III has seen fierce competition from the Chinese Kowoon Heavy Industries' new racer. Moses Lee, CEO of Kowoon, has taken a dominant lead and looks invincible.
The stakes are as high as they can get. Alright. Well, yeah, I don't know why uh, the audio is doing that. I've had that happen before, so... I don't know, just, you know... Sir, I will have to pat you down if you want to come through. Alright. Alright, come on, frisk me. I don't got no weapons. Okay, thank you, sir. This, uh, <laughs> this will be over in no time. Knock him out. Quick, press Q. Quick. Okay, let's go, sir. Thank you. Ooh. Getting a lot of frame drops here, but that's okay. This is a very heavy area. And, um, yeah. I'll just check out what I can see here. Uh, that's her. Hmm. Zipping along on the track. Alright. Well, let's see. What can I do in this level? Uh, details here. A lot going on. Downstairs in the garage. It's how you respond that decides where you'll finish at the end of the day. And the guy was definitely weird. Uh, yeah. Hey, doctor gave me some sort of vitamin hydration. Ooh, security camera. Security camera got me. No, it's for after the race is done. Although it did kind of look like a sort of red one with all the syringes. Let's see, this is uh I can't go in here. I hear she's supposed to be around. Damn. That thing's beyond fixing. The security camera got me again. Crap. What a This guy's got a good uniform. I think I'll take it. First, uh, that's is there a place I can hide them? That's the question. Got some goddamn super glue or something? Huh? Oh, I can't go in there. Turn this on. <laughs> I need a screwdriver for this. Yep. Damn, that thing's beyond fixing. Oops, uh, I wasn't doing anything, buddy. I got a space bubble, and you're in it. <laughs> All right, you know, just uh. Pick up your mop again and try not to get too bothered. Oh, where can I put this guy? Uh, that's not looking good. All right, you know what? Let's just not do that right now. Let's explore a little bit more. Can go in there. VIP access. Okay. Yeah, Looks like Trevor a to good location. Oops, excuse me. Comment on my suit there. Seems like this is the medical tent. Huh. Can I buy a ticket off this guy? <laughs> Can't go through here. That is uh, employees only. Don't forget, this race is all about getting some miles under the hood. It's as much These are the uh, port potties. This guy can't do anything here. This is a place I can't go to. Okay. Man, this is. Uh, it's a big area. <laughs> this is actually pretty huge. I don't know what to do. Got the food stands here. Hmm. Let's just run through this crowd here. Oh my god. Too many people. <laughs> Area. Hmm. 
I think I can exit. Right? Hold on. This is the exit, right? Uh -huh. I'll exit through here then. <laughs> Alright, so try to find another way in. Let's go over here. What's going on here? Tunnel. Okay. Stuttering there, I'm just loading stuff in. There's a tour? Can I join the tour? <laughs> Can't go in here, right? Nice day for it, isn't it? Oh, I can. Hi there. Welcome to the Cronstadt Bayside Hill. Oh. Right. Uh, just walking around, uh, trying to see the sights here. You know, beautiful Miami. Miami's very nice this time of year. Oh, this guy looks important. Why is there a general that here? Is Ted Mendez, one of the country's most influential military-grade money men? Bill, this it's must Ted be here. connected to Just your call before heading over to the Expo building to meet Knox for the new combat android presentation. No, not yet. I'm letting him stew a little. The guy's a genius, and you know what they're like. Desperately lacking in discipline and respect for other people. Last time I tried to have a meeting with him, he had me sitting in a room for four hours before canceling. I'll head up when I feel like it. All right, I'll call you after the presentation. Speak then. What's this? Ted Mendez, a defense funding consultant with the U.S. military, is scheduled for a private demonstration of a new Kronstadt robotics project. Sounds like a way to get up close and personal with Robert Knox, 47. Okay. Sure, why not? Yeah, I'm going to follow these uh, little... Uh, what are they called? Let me let me go back into mission stories. That's what they're called now. Instead of opportunities, they're called mission stories. And uh, I'm gonna follow them because you know what? I need to get the. Uh, I need to complete all these anyways. There's like four of them in this level, or there's multiple. Yeah, I thought that was four. But to uh, you know what you call it, rank up and get new stuff. I'm gonna have to complete them anyway, so why not? Everyone likes turning them off because that's not like proper hitman. But oh, what is that? Coconut. Let me pick that up. Give me that coconut. <laughs> you didn't see anything. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's put him in this, um... What is this? Uh, wood chipper? Yeah, let's not shred him, though. I don't wanna... I don't wanna lose my... <laughs> oh, that was close. That guy almost saw me. Alright. Good enough. Uh, did he drop anything? I don't think he dropped anything. Okay. Ooh. So let's go inside the building here. Let's do the thing. Mr. Mendez, good to see you, sir. The demonstration is scheduled to take place on the upper floors. Please feel free to use the stairs right over there. Yeah. Greetings, sir. Okay. <laughs> Just let me through, I guess. <clears throat> Okay, I need Mr. to. Mendez, right this way, sir. All right. Okay. That is pretty cool. Oh, hello, HR. Yes, it's Ben Wheeler down at the Bayside Center. Need to get over here. Into this room. Here we go. I think this is the room. Hello there, sir. Huh. Ah, Ted. Good to finally see you. Guess traffic was rough. Ah, never mind. Let me show you everything. I'm gonna say something provocative now, Ted. War is going out of fashion. It's dirty, it's just plain bad PR. Nobody wants to exchange their children and loved ones for flags and medals anymore. 
The glory is gone, Ted. But, luckily, Kronstadt has a solution for that. Imagine this. Android infiltrators operating in the field, disguised and fully embedded, ready to strike at a moment's notice. Indestructible robotic operators who can infiltrate the deepest sanctuary of any adversary, striking an unseen fatal blow. A surgical tool for a blunt world. Imagine an army of them, mm -hmm. fully equipped android medics, seeking out wounded servicemen and injured civilians, bringing okay. them to safety or patching them up then and there. Android pilots delivering payloads deep inside enemy territory with uncanny precision and minimal collateral damage. All right, Mendez, it's very straightforward. Let me show you. I sure. just pick any of the pictures on the desk, then I use the scanner to upload the biometric data. Okay. And Palace will do that. Do I have any items? No. Target acquired. WB. All righty. Obviously, the final system won't rely on you manually feeding it biometric data. This is still a prototype. This right. is a pivotal moment in modern conflict solution, Ted. Palace is entirely foolproof. All you need is to pick a photo from the table and scan it just like I showed you. It's perfectly safe. Go ahead. Make my day. Make your day, huh? Well. Um... All right, I guess I'll need to find a photo of you. Take you out. Target acquired. Dummy C. All right. Well, how's that for impressive? Amazing, I know. And just think how much more we can accomplish together. My brains, your money. The sky's the limit here, my friend. Mm, I don't know. Maybe I'm old-fashioned. I still prefer the human touch. You're part of an old institution <laughs> and you prefer the traditional approach. I respect that. But like it or not, this is the future you're looking at. Autonomous synthetic systems will entirely remove human agents from direct engagement. I guarantee this thing will absolutely murder anything you put it up against. Sounds promising. So, Mr. Mendez, impressive so far, yeah? Let me quickly show you our on-site robotics lab. It's small, but state-of-the-art, and it's fully mobile, so you can deploy it anywhere. Huh. He still walks a little faster than these guys when I press the sir. walk button, or what's it called? Whoops. So, as part of the deal, Kronstadt will throw in one deployment cell per five units. Have a lovely day. Outfitted to enable on-site adjustments and calibrations, it'll be shipped in a bulletproof shell and can be dropped anywhere on the planet using the Kronstadt T-37. The race is entering its final lap, so 47. If you any questions or want to see anything again, just let me or McKinnis know. Hmm. I'll let you hang out and look at everything for yourself. Hey, don't be a stranger, Ted. Okay. Don't be a stranger. In this arm. I'm just you gonna. Very... I'm just gonna drop that. Sorry, sir, you drop something? No, I didn't drop anything. This is part of the room. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna pick up the screwdriver. I need a weapon. Give me a weapon. I can't. I can't. Can I go in here? I can go in here. Okay. All right. What is this? Intel item obtained. Hmm. McGinnis, Chief Android Engineer. Series of personal generals. This one, Detail, Palace. Uh, Papa, Dolores. Companion Robot. Okay. Alright, I get that ID card. Here's an Android arm I can pick up. Wait a minute, hold on. Okay, that's yeah, just the arm. Anything in here I can pick up? No? 47, the race is over. Sierra will be coming off the track any time now. Well, I can't do anything about it, alright? I don't even have a gun, so... <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Okay, what else is here? Eh, she won, okay. That's fine. Hmm, what's that on the map? Your ID. 
eating target dummy A, B, and C, but they're all labeled one, two, and three. You know what? Oh, I don't have any coins. Damn it. No coins. <laughs> what kind of hitman doesn't bring coins? Oh, wait, hold on. I'm going to put that in my pocket. <laughs> and I need a knife. Uh, key card, huh? Do I have no key cards? I don't have any scramblers either. Hey, nice threats, buddy. West Wing. Oh, I can go in here. What is this? Okay, I got myself a key card. I got myself a key card. <laughs> Alright, there's nothing else in here. This is a little bridge thingy. Anything in here? Whoa, okay, that's just a security camera, okay. Hmm. I'm push this guy out. <laughs> Lots of witnesses though, I can't do that. Okay. Security cameras. What is this? Where does this go? Oh, that's trespassing. I can't go there. Not yet. I'm not really uh, feeling. I'm not really feeling daring about that. I don't want to uh, go crazy just yet. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, oh, glory hole there. <laughs> That's not what that is, but okay. Uh, let's see. That's going down. This is a conference room. Oh. Collecting pictures of celebrity entrepreneurs now, 40. Okay. Okay. Hmm. What are you thinking? A photo of the man. Oh, there's a knife. I'm going to pick this up and it's in my pocket. <laughs> Take all the knives. This is the bathroom? Okay. Okay, um... I think this might work. Hold on. Let me try this out. Let me scan a photo in here. Oh, I can. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's run through this, uh... Demonstration again. Oh, I think he went, uh... Oh, what is this? I'll pick up these scissors. Those are mine. Nothing else. I think. Okay, that's her. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay, let's do the test again. Come on. No, 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 no. Come here. looks to be in the green here. Great work. Oh, Mr. Knox. I'm ready for another demonstration, Mr. Knox. Great, Ted. Great, I... Don't you know who I am? You're invading my private space here. Don't you know who I am? Great, Ted. Great. I knew you were just playing hard to get. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> Let's do this. This seems to work. <laughs> yeah. This is one of the easy, uh, easy options. There might be some other ones out there. But seeing as I haven't unlocked anything... You know, I want to do a sniper rifle run. Let me give you the rundown again. All right, I think we can skip the intro part. You know why we're building this, Ted. We're building the ultimate infiltration unit. Human looking, driven by the best AI Kronstadt has ever built. A unit capable of full environmental immersion, ready to strike at a moment's notice. 
palace is equipped with extremely advanced facial recognition systems capable of complex skin texture analysis. Ultrasonic 3D information capture ensures the right targets are taken down every time. Hmm. It's so good, I'm willing to stake my life on it. Oh, really? You know what to do, Ted. Bring it. Really? Okay. <laughs> Will this work? Here we go. Oh, okay. I'm just going to walk away from this. Actually, no, wait, hold on. Uh, no. Yeah, I'm going to walk away from this. I was never here. <laughs> and I need to find the um, security office here. Wait, can I go upstairs? Sorry, personnel only. Oh, that's disappointing. You know what? I bet I can get into that office. Ooh. The lights are too bright. I bet I can get into that office. I just need a disguise. Huh. This is uh what is in this room, anyways? Oh, hey. Actually. Let's get in here. What's up here? Can I, uh... Oh, where's this going? Okay. Come on. No, no, no. I want... I want to get off. I want to leave. Can I leave? Oh, no. I have to hang? Oh, <laughs> okay. Sure, why not? Oh, nope. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. <laughs> All right, now I'm trespassing, but that's okay. Uh, who is in here? Lots of science guys. Hmm. Nobody here? Ah, oh, damn it. I need to find a. Oh no! Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Oh no. No, he's not. Okay. You know what? Oh, what's this? A fuse box. Uh oh. Come on, go down, go down, go down. Please go down. Thank you. Let's see what's going to happen here. This is an easy fix. I'm the bad. Girls love a fixer. Is he knocked out? Oh, he's knocked out. That's good. That's good. I will take your uniform, please. Thank you. Oh, actually. Oh, no. <laughs> Damn it. You know what? Oh. Forgot about these guys. Damn it. Oh, this guy. Oh, I can't. Oh, huh. you know what? That's okay. Shortly after electricity was discovered, I know it is difficult to send the baby to No, 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 no. Please don't look down here. Please turn around. There we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. Now we can... Uh... Oh, these guys are going to recognize me. That's great. I'm just going to run really fast. Oh, golf club. Whoop. Wait a minute. <laughs> Why do I have a wrench out? Where is the security room? Is this a security room? I'll pick up these scissors. I'm a scientist. I need scissors. Okay. Every scientist needs a good pair of scissors. Isn't there an AC unit in there? Yeah, Knox wants it like that. He has this issue with his, uh, his left eye. You know, the one that got burned in the accident way back. Hmm. 
I'll take this bust. Look at that. <laughs> you never know when you need a bust. That's a TV. Uh, electrical outlet. Assistance office. And I'll take these scissors. Thank you. <laughs> take all these scissors. Huh. I can't. I have so many things I need huh, to what's this? Fix before this day is over. There's I'll just no that. way. Thank you. Florida man yeah. article. What is this? <laughs> Florida man. Okay. Robert and his daughter are both here. You That's a bathroom. Roof garden. If I can be a security guy, I might have unrestricted access to a lot of stuff. I just need to find a security guard outfit. Uh oh. That's not good. <laughs> Where is the security room? I need to find the security room. Okay. There's nothing in here except for boxes of stuff. Useless. Useless server room. Oh, there is a... Uh, uh, there it is. That's what I want. Whoops. Where are you guys going? You gonna take a break, huh? Oh, this guy's gonna take a break. Hmm. Okay. There's a shotgun here. <laughs> uh, oh, oh crap, I gotta destroy this thing. Let's go, let's go, let's go. There we go. Where are those recordings? Flying through, huh? Man. There's just two of these guys. What's this guy doing? I'm just a scientist, you know, you don't gotta look at me all suspicious like I ain't doing nothing. I'm just admiring the servers. They're very nice servers, you know. <laughs> I don't know what to do in this situation. Um some kitchen knives, scissors, a wrench, a bus. Do I have two busts? No, just one. Okay. So I can throw a wrench. Uh, yeah, I probably throw a wrench and then throw a bus. I don't think anybody's gonna come in here. Oh yeah, actually, I can probably. Oh uh, no! Stay there! Oh damn it! Come on, go outside! Come on, go outside! <laughs> Let's just get away from these guys. Massive slowdown over there. Doctor. Okay, okay. I'm not playing doctor. Throw this wrench at you. Oh no, he saw me. Why? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it, I have to take this guy out. You know what? That's okay. That's alright. There's gotta be a place to hide this guy. Really? Man, okay, you know what? Oh yeah, that's right. He saw me, so um, yeah. Sorry about that, buddy. <laughs> I was trying to do a uh, silent assassin run, but um, oh, where's my bus? Give me my bus. Shut up. <laughs> Give my wrench back. <laughs> okay. I want to drag you into that bathroom where nobody can see you. Take this uh, outfit. There's nowhere to hide him, really? There's no closet? They usually have a closet in the bathroom for some strange reason. Okay. Uh, your buddy there, he didn't do too well. He broke his neck. Alright, there we go. 
just uh, pick up the shotgun. Stick that on my back. Shotgun, and a pistol. Okay. Oh, this guy probably recognized me, huh? Let's uh, let's uh, close the door, please. Can I close the door? Ah, oh, damn it! How do you? How do you? No, I I don't know how to close that door. Yeah. Can't be All right, yeah, I'm just a new guy here, you know. Got my whoa, that guy can recognize me. Okay. Attack the cool. All right, let's just climb down this baby. And uh, slide down the pipe. <laughs> Wee. Yeah, that's no, I'm just a security guy. Oh, shit. Shoot! Wait a minute. Close it. Close it. Oh, okay. I put him inside the closet. I forgot. <laughs> Sorry about that. I thought I left him out in the open. Uh, you know, try to cover my tracks there. <laughs> okay. Ah, good. Somebody like Sierra needs me. The victims were identified. Car reader. Delgado Sicarios by their cartel. Huh. And the massacre is believed Sebast to be retaliation Sebastian Sato. for the brutal dismembering of Moreno cartel boss Esteban Montoya's huh. beloved nephew. From the last game. I poisoned him. I think I did. Oh, I mean that uh, poison. Emetic. And that screwdriver. You never know when you need uh, another screwdriver, you know. It's always a good idea to carry multiple. This guy. Ooh, he would have been a good target right here. <laughs> Let's, uh, nobody here? Nobody, right? Okay. Oh. Let's just take him out. You never know when you need another disguise. You know? Just, just in case. Oh, this guy. Oh. Thanks <laughs> for making me feel safe, sir. Oh no, I didn't have time. I right, need that. Oh, what is this? Podium Club Pass. Oh, well, I could have been useful if I was still a civilian. But no, I am a um, security guard. No, I'm walking around with a shotgun. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, bad, bad. <laughs> it's bad. Don't turn here. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna walk that way. Just leave me alone, please. Oh, how long is this video already? 38 minutes? Wow. <laughs> this, is a, this is a very big mission. I'm only halfway done. Just get out of the way, people. Seriously. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna push you out of the way. Just move. Oh yeah, okay. VIP access. I am a security guard. Would you take a bullet for Sierra? Okay, alright, cool. I can go in here. That's good. Whoa. Oh, slow down there. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Blend in. Blend in the crowd. Okay, I'm just, you know, I'm guarding this crowd. <laughs> Push them aside. Alright, alright. I will try to find another, another route. Alright, okay. alternate route. We're going to get to this other target one way or the other. I'm just going to go this way. Oh yeah, that's nice. Not that many people here. Oh, actually, where's my, um, let me check my map here. What is my agency pickup? Oh, ah, it's over there. Oh, snap. Because I don't have a suppressed weapon. 
<laughs> I was just gonna make do, okay? Like I said, I'm just gonna. Hey, I'm just gonna. Alone? No? Uh, probably sleeping in a closet somewhere. <laughs> I'm just gonna roll with it, you know? Adapt, improvise, react. Let's pick up the soda. What else is here? Uh, it's the pit building key card, okay. No, just me, uh. No, have a drink. Get my. What is that? Fitter? Well, there we go. That's what I like. Dr. Pep. That's my type of drink right there. Okay. Um, is there a um, thing here? Actually, uh. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. If you just. If you, um. Delete one security system. I guess you don't have to do the other ones, so. Okay, she's down there. Having a great time. Great time, you know? She's having some fun. There she is. That and is Sierra Knox. Reckless daredevil with a violent temper. Quite the handful, as I understand it. Oh, man. Bloom is just killing my eyes here. Okay, she's going that way. I am going to have to... Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, keep going. Oh, crap. Why would you do that? Just tailing my target. Blending into the crowd. Okay. Hey there, buddy. I'm just, uh, I'm just securing the grounds, you know. I have my Dr. Pep in my hands. Oh, oh no. Uh, bad idea. Oh, come on. There's like two people here that can recognize me. Damn it. What can I use in here? Okay, he's going that way. Yeah, I'm just, you know, yeah, I'm just guarding the stairs with my Dr. Pep. I'm always coming this way. I gotta move, I gotta move. Who are you, who are you? Alright, I'm just gonna go this way. You don't notice me. I'm not here. Oh crap! This is bad. 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 <laughs> I'm blending into the crowd. I'm just watching a little TV with my Dr. Pep. Dr. Pep. <laughs> uh, so perfect. Oh, well, that's not really perfect because I'm in a crowd and uh, not a good idea. Alright, gather up my Dr. Pep. This guy. Don't bother me. Inside the crowd. We're following. Oh, actually, I'm actually going to walk really slow. What is that? Confetti? Security looking hella tight today. Keeping it real, what? Please don't turn around. Okay, you know, I'm just, I'm not doing anything. I'm just walking the grounds. You know? Yeah. Right, go inside. Yes. Is there any doors that lead in there? Okay, good. Let's just go this way. Oh, please. Oh, no, there's a guy here. Damn it. Time to throw some scissors. <laughs> the deadliest weapon. 
<laughs> Not the best kill in the world, but it it works, you know? It works. I'm going to have to experiment with some other stuff. Oh, can't unlock this. Damn it. I need to go out this way. Again, not the best kill, but you know what? I need to finish this mission and move on to the next one. And uh, that's one way to do it, you know? I don't know who saw me. Someone saw me. <laughs> just a bald security guard just threw scissors into the... It's nobody. I'm nobody. I am nobody. Leave me alone. Get out of here. There we go. All right. All right, 46 minutes. Not too bad. 39 if you believe the game timer. But yeah, let's uh let's see what I unlocked. Got to crack my knuckles here. That was a white knuckle right there. That was uh that was very tense. Tension-filled mission. <laughs> All right. Let me see what I got. Got those, got that, got that. What else? That one. Uh-huh. Okay. Seems like about a briefcase, huh? I don't understand. All right. Let's see. I'm level 20. Oh, 19 right now, huh? <laughs> Mission rating one star. Okay, you know, that was just a trial run. Okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. That was pretty bad, but you know, next time I'll get it when I play the mission again. Uh, what did I unlock? Okay, hidden stash. All loadout slots available. All right, good, good, great. I got a briefcase. I got a fish. Lockpick Mark II. Huh. I don't know what the difference is between Mark I or II, but whatever. Dolphin Fountain. Marina. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I'll do that one later. Uh, let's skip that one. We need to fight the sickness, not the symptoms. Is that Bruce Willis? <laughs> and I have just the tool for the job. Ooh, VR. Right. The Burnwood woman. Eric Soders warned you about her, didn't he? The Crusader. I can handle this Burnwood. Everyone hates power until you offer them some. And you ought to know. ICA speaks the enemy's language. We need them. And once we don't, <laughs> we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Fact remains, we are shadow boxing. We need to know who we are up against. I was getting to that. His name is Lucas Gray, the late Mr. Cobb's head of security. Cobb was ground zero, first of our operatives to die. It had to be one of his staff, someone with military training and access to the plane. Yeah, grasping at straws. Ray is a mercenary, a veteran of every backwater tragedy you've ever ignored on the five o'clock news. Chechnya, Sierra Leone, the list goes on, but before 89, nothing. 
No records of any kind. Oh, come on. CIA, KGB, plenty of spies went dark. After the curtain was lifted, I cast a very wide net. Lucas Gray simply does not exist. <clears throat> if you're all quite done wetting yourselves with excitement, I couldn't give two shits where he came from. I only want to know one thing. How does he know about us? Wow, this is pretty long. <laughs> I swear to God, this hearts and flowers crap will get us both killed. Can't you see? Your so-called friend is working for them now. He's not the man you knew. This is his fight too, Olivia. Even if he doesn't realize it. Like it or not, 47 is our last and only lead on the partners. He needs to remember. He's coming for us. And unlike you, he won't hesitate. Just get me inside. Rico, I need a favor. All right, there we go. <laughs> Little story cinematic for you. And uh, yeah, that was the um, that was the second level. Pretty cool. Finish line. All right, yeah. So, anyways, that's uh, about it for right now. I'll come back and play the rest of these missions later. <laughs>